Hey guys, it's Flypark Effects here, and in this video, I'm gonna give you some simple tips on how to change the speed using your graph editor. Now, in this example, I've got four balls moving along the screen. Now, the thing to note is that they all start at the exact same time, and they all finish at exactly the same time. But what happens in between is very different. Now on my top ball here, I've just created a simple transition between two keyframes. And if I select the position properties, I can select the graph editor. And if I make sure that edit speed graph is on, I can now see the graph for the speed. Now, because this has a constant speed, you don't see any change in this line. But if I scroll down to the next ones, you can see that I've got some different layouts for each of these different balls. Now, a quick thing to do is I can select any of these key points and I can move them using these arrows up and down to create different speed effects. Now, the thing to note here, we have the speed in time in pixels per second on the left and our duration over the bottom. So you can mess around by dragging and adjusting these keyframes at the start and the end to get different speed effects. The other thing you can do is come down here and use presets to automatically change the default animation for these. So there you go guys, there's a quick introduction to how you can change the speed of your animations using the speed graph inside of After Effects. I hope you've learned something and I'll catch you in the next tutorial.